How to make traditional carbonara. You need about two egg yolks per person, so we're three people at the moment. Then you're going to whisk those together very quickly. You're going to grate about 200 grams of parmesan. Just pop some pepper in there. Carbonara is made with guanciale, but we're in the UK at the moment and I can't find guanciale, so I'm using pancetta, but it's just as nice. We're going to pop the pancetta into a pan and going to fry that till it's nice and crispy. What we're going to do is we're going to mix that mixture together so it looks kind of like a paste. In the meantime, we're going to boil the water for the pasta and remember to salt the water. What you're going to do is when the pancetta is nice and crispy, or the guanciale, you're going to remove it so you get the oil to one part remove it and pop it in a dish. Then get a spoonful of the oil that's come off the meat and pop that into the egg mixture. Now the important part is how I got swag out of it like this. <laughs> okay, so this is the really important part. You want to take the pasta when it's al dente, when it's hard. You don't want to drain it. You <laughs> stop laughing at my cameraman is laughing at me. You want to take the pasta and pop it into the pan with the rest of the oil in there. We're going to take the pasta water and add it to this mixture here. And we're going to mix that in until we get a nice creamy mixture. We're going to take the mixture and pop it in that pan. The pan is not on the heat. And then we're just going to mix it all together. Mm -hmm. And that is the finished product.